Hello everyone. Today we will see how to solve common Arduino errors, download and set up the Arduino IDE and upload your first code to the board. So let's dive straight in. To begin with any of the Arduino projects, we need the code file. So go to the description of any project video and download the code file from the link provided. Once downloaded, we will notice the file is in .ino format. If we try to open it and our PC doesn't have an application for it, that's because we need Arduino IE. Let's download the Arduino IDE. Open any browser and search for Arduino IDE. Scroll down to the legacy IDE section. Choose the version for your operating system like Windows 10 and click just download. Enter your email. Once downloaded, run the installer, allow permissions and open the Arduino IDE after installation. Now let's test if everything works fine. Open the IDE, go to file, then examples, click on basics and then blink. This is a simple program to make an LED on your Arduino board blink. Next, connect your Arduino board to your PC using the USB cable. Go to tools, then port and select the port which is showing as COM5 in my case. To confirm the correct port, open device manager on your PC, go to ports, COM and LPT and check for COM5 or a similar port. Now compile the code by clicking verify and then click upload to send the code to your Arduino. Oops, we have got an error. This happens because CH340 driver is missing. The CH340 driver is essential for Arduino boards with CH340 chips as it allows your PC to communicate with the board properly. To fix this, search for CH340 driver in your browser. We have also provided a direct link in the description to make it easier for you. Download the driver, install it and follow the instructions carefully. After installing the driver, go to Device Manager, click on COM5, then go to Driver, then Update Driver or use Rollback Driver if needed. This ensures the correct driver is in use. Now close all applications, refresh your PC and reopen the Arduino IDE. Once open the code file again, reselect the port and board and click Upload once more. And there you go, your code is successfully uploaded and the LED on your Arduino board is blinking as expected. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. See you in the next video.